Good evening everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jellybean and we are back today playing EU4 is the Angevin Empire. Um, currently in the middle of a war against uh, Aragon slash Portugal. I mostly am just looking to farm some prestige because I'm hoping we can uh, claim Lithuania's throne, but they've got 94, so they've got a lot more than us. Uh, how much prestige do we get from this? Does it say? I'm assuming it will down here. We only get four prestige from that. Eesh. We'd get a lot more by making them... ...and their rivalries. Hmm... What about Aragon here? I mean, I know I want these two. That's not even a question right now. So with this, we get... 8 prestige. This will be 20 away. But we could have them end their rivalry here. We could have them end their alliance with Portugal. We could make them give us some war reps, maybe give up some claims. That's a good... so this would give us how much? 16.8. Okay, cool. That would give us 83, and then if we can get Portugal to and some rivalries or something, it would probably work. Let's get down here with this guy. And I don't know this guy, or these guys just lost their general. And I am just trying to be a little wary of uh, aggressive expansion right now. It's not what I wanted. Why can't... Oh, they built uh, a fort there. Dumb. Where is our navy? Right here. Now let's just wait. Just a two siege there. Yeah, I guess we can just keep sitting here for now. I know. Jesus. I know as time goes on, we should be able to take more. How many, hang on, how many provinces? Oh yeah, Malacca's in this too. I shouldn't have co-belligerented Portugal. It is what it is, I guess. Hopefully that's a stack wipe. We'll see though. No, no. Keep sieging down Fez. There we go. One more month. Perfect. Alright, why don't... Why don't you come down here then? I 
I'm actually curious right now. 89. So they are going down at least. Oh, looks like they won that. Alright, switch that down as well. Uh oh. Maybe I don't want to land there. Actually, probably fine. Hopefully. Hey, there we go. Is that most of that's Aragon's entire army stack wiped? It's Drylands. Let's wait here just a second. Hey, cool, we captured their flagship. That's amazing. Yeah, that's awesome. That gives us prestige. Okay, Portugal. Um, any chance you'd be willing to accept peace? Probably not. Although maybe now instead of wrong one. Instead of breaking off alliances and stuff, we can actually take some land. Uh, let's not do anything there. Okay, so we could take some stuff over in the New World, so why don't we? Start by doing this. I want to get up... Occupied by Spain. Okay. I don't understand why they would take control of it when they can't make it a core, but whatever. Let's grow our provinces here. Oh. I won't take any more. So I want these two as well. Yeah, that one and this one. Yep, okay. So that's what I want. And actually that might go to Brazil, so let me... Let me just make sure it connects. Let's just take all of that. We want this one as well. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Yeah, I'm fine. Uh, I'm fine waiting a little bit. Two siege, three siege. Okay. Just go sit on it then. Oh fuck. <laughs> God damn it. I didn't think we were actually going to catch up to them. Where are you guys going? Don't actually know. Whatever. 
Is that enough for Portugal? Not quite. Damn. November 28th, there we go. Let's upgrade these ships and then click A just so they can heal up and then let's blockade this. Uh, the port's actually over here. Actually, that's fine. Perfect. Now we can come blockade this. Oh. And there we go, we could peace out if we wanted to. Um, how much aggressive expansion do we get with people? Minus... I'll just say minus 10, basically. With It's not a whole lot. Uh, can I see... I don't know if Hungary would be on here at all. We get a lot with Castile, but I don't really care about Castile. Hungary, we get minus nine. Um, that's two or three years worth. That's probably fine. You know what? Yeah, that's fine. I want to grow our subjects, and it gives us prestige. So, how much prestige? Four and a half. And how much does Lithuania have? 88. Okay. Oh, is this stuff in a... It's in a f new... New thing, so we can't core it. Really? If I'd known that, I would have just taken this. Like a coastal province. I thought it was going to go to Brazil. I'm an idiot. <laughs> Brazil or Argentine. Oh, balls. Can I seize, like, Kalama from... Argentine? I'm assuming not. Yeah, no, unfortunately not. Get those guys loyal at least. We'll do that too. Make sure that they stay loyal. Hopefully. Where's Florida? 86. We're already supporting loyalists there. Hmm. Well... Where do we go from here? You know what? <sighs> I'll be right back. All right, I am back. I, uh, <laughs> I guess, yeah. I decided to just burn the game quick. Um, I think it, well, I know I took like five coastal provinces or something like that. Um, but, uh, so the provinces are a little bit different, but basically it was the same. I, uh, yeah, I really didn't feel like trying to deal with, uh, not being able to court any of those provinces. I should have checked, but whatever. It, uh, it is what it is. Um, these guys can all... Oh, no, they can't, they can't get to the Mamluks. Okay, whatever then. Let's just... Do something like this. Actually, I 
and move you over like that. You're going up there. And you need to come siege this down. Actually, whoops, hang on, before I forget, Lithuania. Good, I can, I can claim Lithuania's throne. Ooh, they actually hate us now. Did we send them a gift? We did send them a gift. Okay. When does our truce end with them? 1683. October of 1683. I should have waited. Ah, just kidding. No, because I think... I think the CB lasts... Oh, we'd have to fight Poland. Interesting. Ooh, we could call in Russia. Okay, Aragon, all I want are these two provinces. I don't care about anything else. Maybe something like that, I guess. That works. All right, let's move you up here then. Oh, balls. Do it that way, perfect. Alrighty, so. Does it say how long this truce lasts? Or war goal lasts? Is it until they get any air or just a strong air? I'm trying to remember what I've seen. I've seen something online about it. I wish I remembered. Trade some favors for trust. Hey, we're up to 69 trust now. Nice. Okay, I do want to go to war then. With them. Ooh, Poland's got a ton of troops. So 237,000. I mean, we've got 469. So, I, I mean, just us, we've got more troops than them. Um, let's work on getting these troops across. Can you guys, you can't get down there, so that's fine. Protect trade in the North Sea instead, please. I don't feel like trying to deal with you. Tech trade in the English Channel works. Okay. So we're gonna want to get our troops over, actually over into Brandenburg. So instead of there, let's just drop you off right there. Um, and then we've got all of these guys here that need to come up to Brandenburg. There, not black flagged anymore, so now I don't have to worry about uh, him taking a wrong route. There. So we're all going to do something like that then. Am I overextended? I am overextended. Interesting. Not for long though, hopefully.
Okay. They still don't have an heir. That's good. Part of me wants to just do it now. Oh, we could actually take Gotland too. Call in Russia. It's gonna suck a little bit. What does this give us? Some better infantry, some higher tactics. You know what, let's do it. Three two three or three three three. Nope, definitely that. One four four. Oh nope, definitely the uh, one five fives. You can wait a month, I guess. Don't care. All right. P Lithuania. I kind of wish I knew how long it for sure lasted. You know what, let's just do it. Unfortunately, we're going to be... a little behind on uh, admin points to get... get our stability back up, but it is what it is. Get you an admiral. Hey, there we go. It's a good admiral. So that's perfect. Oh fuck, I forgot to call in Russia. Oh, there we go. <laughs> oh man, alright. Whoops. Du -du -du, wrong one. Oh, we're so close. 155. All right, I need my four siege generals here, please. Who do you have? David Howe, okay. Get uh, Ernest, whatever, I guess, I don't care. Oh, you can also go there, okay. Oh, you've, go there. You've got a four siege, so go there. We are going to stack armies up together. Uh, you, can you get through here at all? No, unfortunately not. That's alright. Um, Our navy's under attack. Perfect. All right. Um, I don't know the best place to sit. Why don't we just come blockade this for now? Can you get through here now or no? No, okay. Um, I actually want you to turn around and come siege down. Oh, we can't get through. That's fine. Um, I messed up somewhere. Actually, go there, go there. Make sure I'm doing all that stuff. Across the Sealand, unfortunately, yeah, the English Civil War is gonna tick up until we can get to uh, three stability. All 
How many troops does Russia have? 104. Okay. I just need to white piece Poland. I don't care about uh, taking land or anything from them right now. There we go, that's Hamburg's army. See if we can come hit that. Okay, Glogau's over, perfect. They can occupy that if they want, I don't care that much. Um, so get down there next. Why don't you have a, oh yeah, you took generals away. Is there anybody else that doesn't have a general? These guys don't. And somehow I missed these two. Well, the Oldenburg then. We are a little blockaded up there, but that's all right. Hey, there we go. Poland, would you take a, a white piece? No. Uh, is Krakow? No. Warsaw. Right there. There's the capital. I swear I've got to uh, try to get to. Can I? Fortunately not. I can't get up to Wiesna, so go over there. And I want you to f start following up behind. Actually, I lied. Go there. Go to Krakow, please. Okay. Still not quite there. Yeah, nope. Unfortunately, I think we've got to take this. We can, uh, we've got the mill points available, so let's do that. Is it. Okay, hang on. Let me. June 15th, 1683. So a June. Okay, I think we'll. I think we'll be fine. Alright, and go sit on Varshava now. Yeah, I think this is going to be... I think once we step on Varshava, we can probably peace out. No, interesting. Okay, so we're just gonna have to siege it down. But that's actually all right. I don't care that much about it. Oh, I forgot to uh, come deal with this stuff. Um, let's just do automatic transport there. With th that, we might actually be able to peace out. Oh, still no. Interesting. Can we get these guys up here now? Yes. Okay, good. February 11th, February 10th. A day apart's fine. Oldenburg is over. We captured Varmia. Or occupied it. What the f- why? You could go there before, but not now. Same with you. You could go there before, but not now? I don't- 
<laughs> what the fuck is going on? What? What? <laughs> oh. Brought. <laughs> God damn, really? Ah, uh, Jesus, okay. Okay. I, I hope that's not one of the ones that were... Coring up, I swear to God, if it is, I don't think so. No, it's not. Okay, good. I would have actually been a little mad <laughs> if it was. We could boost it, but I know. Yeah, see, plus fifty-six percent from overextension. If we could just finish coring this, and actually, hang on, when July. Okay, that's fine. We I can wait till July. Okay, there we go. I can pretty much guarantee... Oh my god, we can't... <laughs> we still can't. That's nuts to me. Okay, how long? March 30th. Okay. Um, I like... I like the stability, but I also like the Diplo power. Let's do the Diplo power. I don't care because... Oh, fuck. Honestly, we can start integrating like Italy then, but no, we can't because we're at war. And I didn't scourge them. Oh, that's... Probably all right. Should you just go there and you go there. Any chance? Nope. I was say any chance of us capturing that, but no, unfortunately not. I can't believe Poland won't be so. Finally, God damn! There we go. Okay. So you need to go there. E um, you need, I can't get there. Okay. Stop moving. We're black flagged. Uh, of course we are. Okay. I really wish like Argentine would help us. I'm assuming they're disloyal though. They are unfortunately. These guys have no reason to be disloyal, I'm gonna be honest. Let's just do that. Alright, will you guys actually help out now, please? No, I can't. I don't know what just happened. Um, okay. So you need to come down like this. You guys have a four siege general. You need to come like this. I'm assuming you also have a four siege general. Yes. Why don't you just go there for now? All 
Alright, can you guys go there then? You can, okay. You can't make it to Riga. Just go sit there then. What are you guys doing? Nothing. Just go sit there. I actually kind of like that. Hungary is now positive. Interesting. Okay, let's uh, let's send them a gift. Three thousand tickets is actually just fine. Oh my god. Oh, are these guys actually helping? I hope so. Uh, let me go here quick. I want to make sure... I think... July 2nd. Yeah, I think we're fine on that end. Our naval reformer died. Let's do... Diplo Reputation instead. Please. Oh, this general. It was that died. Good. <sighs> oh, these guys are just soon they're taking attrition. There we go. Finally. Got a three siege, so that's fine. On Habsburg in Poland, that's fine, because I know. Fortunately, we're not going to be able to do a whole lot with Poland anymore. Please capture Gotland. There we go, perfect. And we wiped out their navy. Do they have any armies? No. So they might actually take a piece right now then. Yes, they would. Good. That's what I wanted. Looks like these guys are dealing with the rebels for us. Yes, they are. Okay, cool. I'm really, really glad for that. Oh, we did get another merchant. Oh, where should we trade f or uh, steer from? We could steer from the Krakow. It's probably that's probably the play here. Yep, 
Yeah, let's steer from Krakow. Where do we probably want it going to Saxony? Hopefully that actually does something. Hopefully. We've got it going up there. I don't think that's what I want. Yeah, that's... I think that's the way to do it. Um, I don't know. I thought I had somebody going south, but maybe not. So Riga, I don't actually care about. So what I want from Lithuania here is... Union with Lithuania. All I want. I don't care about anything else. Just kidding. I mean, if they would give me money, I would take some money just so I could maybe pay off their loans to make them happy again with me. Something like this. Alright, Siege of Luki is over. Just Lithuania and Riga. Um, who's the fourth siege guy? I think it's him. Yeah, okay. So we're going to send you to Riga. And then... Just do something like that. Um, we should get you, I guess just back like this. Something like this. Cool. Hang on. Just do something like this, I guess. Uh, I don't know where I had everybody, so let's just do something like this, I suppose. At the end of the day, I don't think it matters a whole lot. Institution spread is fine. Alright, there we go. Union with Lithuania. Thank you. Now, with that, they absolutely despise us, which I suppose is to be expected. People are moving, so let's... Oh, fuck. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. I forgot to stab up. In York and Shrewsbury. Okay. Well...
can we get you over to York? Everybody looks to be kind of done moving. So I just want to get uh, get the armies back together. Two tens and two nines is what I'm looking for. Two tens and two nines. I'm missing a ten there. Two tens, two nines, and two tens and two nines. Perfect. All right. How long? Oh, these guys are already here. Uh, for the Emperor. Yeah, no, definitely for the Emperor. Six, six general is perfect. Unfortunately, I wasn't sitting there. down there please hopefully okay perfect no debate in Parliament. Let's uh, let's start one here. We're going to do support the war effort. Maybe the free stability would be nice. Mint national coins. Oh yeah, that's fine for sure. I wonder why, because, oh, like this one, Derby, Chester, and Moolhouse. Why is it like that? Interesting. Uh, we can also get a free stab there like that. There we go. Okay, so how... How do we get rid of this? Oh, okay, so we should get rid of it. There we go. Enact the absolute British monarchy tier one gov reform. Hang on. So before we click this, let's look at. I'm just curious. So we're at 78. Holy shit. <laughs> hey, that's cool. Okay. We also finished the Three Kingdoms Wars here, which gives us some um, monarch points. Oh wait, no, never mind. Unlock. Unlock Parliament issues which can modify our national ideas. And then until the end of the game we get legitimacy, loyalty. Hey, that's cool. And the law adjustments, what does this do? 
Parliament issues which alter our national ideals will no longer... Yeah, no, I don't want that. Russia, yeah, that's fine. Lithuania is a little disloyal, which... Probably to be expected. Uh, nothing I can really do. Interesting. Okay. Brandenburg. I want to annex you. Why are we only at 80 crown land? Interesting. Anyways, Brandenburg, let's placate, placate, do a dev click. And now we're going to annex you. Alright, what are we doing next? Pardon me wants... Ooh, we can ally... Let's Royal Mary Hungry next. We should give out strong duchies as well now, just because we've got such high maximum absolutism. Alright, so yeah, Hungary we are... I probably didn't need to ally them, but I want to make sure... That they actually stayed, uh... Happy with me or whatever. I'm a little surprised. Hang on, let me... Guess expansion is 192, and that I feel like that's what it was before. I'm really surprised that we didn't, that they didn't get a ton of aggressive expansion from us taking Lithuania. Yeah, I want to get hungry next, though. I think we're gonna be. I think we're gonna finish that campaign though, bef or the campaign before we're able to do that though. We're only three years ahead of time, so we're not gonna do. We're not going to take this idea yet. I don't even know. Autonomy change? Yeah, it doesn't matter a whole lot. Hmm. Our missionaries are done. Oh, uh, that's fine. I don't care, I guess. Um, minus 164. What are we at for improved relations? So we can only get another 70. I can send them a gift. Might as well. I don't need to offer mill access or anything like that. And then I could probably influence them. There we go. Get them a little bit more loyal with us. This will put them at minus 40 by the time we finish improving relations. Yeah, I'm, I'm hoping we're good with, with Lithuania there. This guy's 42, so... Potential that he dies, but I'm really hoping he doesn't. Cool, Gotland's ours. Um, how old is he? 28, that's right. No overextension now either. So, are these guys. No, did they have a little bit of rebels? 
I'm really hoping that somebody will help them out. Didn't you already ask? And I said, no, you can't be... You can't have a parliamentary seat. Pretty sure I did. Are we losing? Yeah, we are losing some. I wonder if I should help Angevin Peru. Oh, there we go. Argentina is actually helping them there. That's good. Alright, can you guys deal with these rebels or no? Why are they having so many issues? Why are they having so many issues? The highest on rest I see is only two. And that's, I mean, it's not like that's a lot. Interesting. Um, yeah, I can spend a thousand. What the f- Alright, I am back. I hope you guys aren't, uh, I guess upset by that. Um, but <laughs> what's, <laughs> what's the point, I guess, of fighting- uh, I suppose I could be drilling, but what's the point of what's the point of fighting Lithuania again when we just fought them and showed that we could beat them? And even if, like, I mean, I don't, they don't have any allies, but like, they've got a hundred thirty-three thousand troops. We have 474. We have four times the troops that they do. Three and a half. Whatever. Like, it It would do nothing but waste waste time, I guess. So, whatever. Like I said, I, I hope you guys aren't upset by that. But I've already shown that I can beat Lithuania. We've already got them in a union. What's the point of wasting everybody's time to fight them again? When, like I said, I've already shown that we can beat them up. Beat them in a war, whatever. I just don't see... I don't see a reason to waste time like that. Okay, so, plus we were a few months away from actually... Getting positive relations with them. Okay, maybe not a few months. Maybe it'll be more like a year and a half, but still. God damn. Just like that, all these journals are dying. Um, what else could I do to get... Uh them happy with me. We could give some subsidies, maybe. I should do it. Screw it. We got the money for it. Mm, religion, that's right. That's what we're looking at. Alright, let's get Lithuania happy with us, and then... After Lithu- Did that just- hang on, did that just say Denmark? Is Denmark alive? They are right here. Why? Oh, Sweden took some land. I wonder if, uh... I wonder if Sweden made Novgorod 
just uh, released Denmark. Oh, man, all these <laughs> these generals just keep dying. Ooh, that was the five siege guy. I feel like now might be a good time to go to war with uh, with Sweden. Yeah, let's uh, let's do that. Oh, we don't have a CB. Sweden is guaranteed by Russia. Why Russia are you guaranteeing them? What the fuck? <laughs> are we still... Okay, good. We are still guaranteeing the Ottomans. Brandenburg is not disloyal. That's good. Hang on. So who who are you allied with Sweden? Bohemia and Utrecht. Okay. Well, I can go to war with Utrecht, I think. Where there you are. Oh yeah, Austria would join. And that's actually fine with me. Could we call in? We could call in Hungary and Russia. We're not going to call belligerent Sweden. We'll just take their provinces, I think. Let me check here. Total war score caught 59. Jesus Christ. Okay, so if I declare war on Utrecht... And co belligerent Sweden. I'm assuming Russia joins. Yeah, unfortunately. Well, maybe. Maybe over time. As our absolutism goes up. Oh, it's almost at 100, anyways. Icelandic separatists? Why? Why are you guys unhappy? Rebel sentiment. Nope. Harsh treatment. And that gives... Absolutism. So, boom, 100 absolutism. It's 58. Yeah, I bet we can't fully annex them. And we're, where's Utrecht? That's not what I meant. Oh, yeah, Bohemia. Well, we could white peace Bohemia. You know what? I don't think I want to take... I think I just want these four provinces. I might give, if I can, these ones to Russia. Oh, we'll see, though. Um... We've actually got some f favors with them, so let's trade some favors for trust. So we can do it twice, that's fine. There, trust is almost at 100 with them now. Um, so yeah, let's go to war with Utrecht. I don't know if I'm going to take any other land. Who does that bring in? Saxony? Yeah, I don't know if I would want to take anything from them. Ingolstadt. I don't think I want anything from them. 
Aachen. Where's Aachen? Oh, right there. <laughs> they just look pretty much the same. I might want something from them. Uh, not enough to go belligerent. I'll just, I can probably just take something from them. So, let's declare war for Friesland. Um. You've got a four siege general, so... Go there. Where's our five siege? Right there. Go to Varsava, please. Oh my god. And then you three... I don't know, go there, go there, go there. I did forget that I was going to call in Hungary and Poland, or uh, Russia, excuse me. Another one of you two are doing anything? Okay, go up to Tula and Kaluga then. I'm hoping the Netherlands will actually siege down Friesland since it's their war goal, but I wouldn't be surprised if they didn't. So <sighs> we are going to be out of time though, guys. If you guys enjoyed the episode today, go ahead and click the like button. Don't forget to click the subscribe button as well. New content every day at 12 noon Eastern time, and we'll see you again next time.